Uh, let me walk you to the set to create this part. First, create the sketch of the base feature on the top plane. I click the top, select sketch, draw a center rectangle, dimension this, line 95. Okay, click on this line and make it a construction geometry. The next, we are going to use three point up. Click here, click here, and drag to the right click. Make sure the center point is coincident to the center line. Next, dimension this up, radius 40. Okay, now the sketch is fully de defined and extrude 20 mm. 20 mm. Yeah, we go to, go to feature, extrude, make it 20. Type in 20. Okay. Okay, the next part is we are going to create a plane. So you use this command, the plane command. Choose the, for first reference, you choose the face. Your second reference, your second reference will be the edge here. And you know that uh, the angle is 120 degree, so I need to key in an angle of 30 degree because 90 plus 30, 120 degree. Click OK. Okay, I try to hide the plane. So we are going to sketch on the plane. Click plane, sketch. Number two. Okay, drag this one down a little bit. So we are going to draw this profile. So I click center line. I draw a center line. Make sure it's vertical. You can see the the symbol that will tell you it's vertical. Click. Okay. And we are going to use this command called dynamic mirror entity. I click this one. I, I click on this line. So whatever you draw on this side, it will be mirror to the other side. So let's sketch a line from here up. Make sure it's vertical. From the icon there, you can tell. Next, we are going to draw an up. Okay, three point up. Click here. Make sure it's, it's the, the inference. I tell you, you're drawing a vertical line. Vertical. The next point must be vertical. Then drag to this side. Uh, make sure that the center is collinear with the edge there. Click. Okay, next we draw the line. Now we are going to dimension this this height here as ninety five. Make it ninety five. Just to make sure that the center and this. This point here is vertical. Next, 
they will dimension this up as radius so when you are dimensioning don't don't click the this point here you must click away then you can dimension 25 so let's close the sketch by drawing a line okay now we finish off by drawing two more circles concentric to the to the other circle And dimension this one again twenty five. Okay, now the sketch is fully defined, so I I put into isometric view, and then we have, we got a feature as root. The distance is twenty. So rate twenty, you merge the result. Okay. So it's in the wrong direction. Click edit feature. So I must change the direction. Click OK. Now it's still two solid body two. I think it's wrong. Click edit feature again. Make sure you match the result. So you have one solid body. Next, you are going to sketch, sketch on this plane, draw the boss. Click this space, sketch, normal two, and we are going to draw two circles, concentric to this outer, outer edge here. Click again, and let's dimension 35, 65. 35 this diameter is 65 okay put the sketch fully defined okay let me put into isometric view again and go feature shoot and shoot 25 25 okay so the last part here is to draw is to draw the rib here okay uh, one thing i want you to remember is that when you draw this line make sure that it is coincident to the edge. Otherwise, you cannot use the rip command. Then you have to use the. Uh, you, can, you have to draw the profile and then extrude it. So we are going to use the rip command. So click the front plane, sketch normal two. Uh, make sure you draw the line concentric. Concentric to the to your model. You wait a while. I skip. You can see the concentric symbol here, the icon. Okay, let us skip. Just exit the sketch. Then we go to feature. The rib. Uh, the arrow is facing down, it's correct. It's, the distance is 16. So, I tap 16. Enter. Okay, okay. Okay, now the rib is formed. And then the last part is you fill it 10 mm here. These two fill it. So, we go to fill it. And I'm already 
Take the year 10 mm. Okay. Attract. Select the edge here. Select the edge. Okay, we have finished the model. Thanks for watching.